A lot of people want to know, like, how did you know something was wrong with Abigail? She started experiencing some back pain. The theory was maybe she had a little bit of scoliosis, maybe she needed to do some physical therapy, but I just had this feeling that it was something bigger than that. Dr. Albert comes in and he's like, well, we know that it's a sarcoma, but we're not sure like really what kind. That's what this biopsy is gonna help us determine. And um, I said, wait a minute. What is this sarcoma word that everybody keeps talking about? And he's like, kind of explained that it's a cancer. So I lost it, of course. I had to sit Abigail down and talk to her about cancer. And she took it well, <laughs> because she, she's so innocent. I've been so mean to her sometimes. I've been mean to her because I know that she can beat this. When Abigail decided I don't want to eat and she started losing a lot of weight, and I was watching her die, I pushed her hard. I pushed her really hard to live. wasn't as obvious with Kendrick. When we got to the helicopter pad, I was kind of excited about it. You know, we're going on a helicopter, Mom. Wow, cool, this is so awesome. And I'm like choking it back and I knew, I knew something else was wrong. Kendrick has ALL leukemia. I was like, did he still mind? Do I still have it? Does mom have it? There's like a lot of questions. How does this happen to both of my kids? I don't know how to make this fun for him like I did Abigail because he doesn't understand. I didn't have to because his sister did. He wasn't scared of the ivy pulse. He had already been there with her. He wasn't bothered by having to wear a mask all the time because Sissy's already doing it. People at Children's became kind of our extended family. And so I think, although you don't ever want to get used to coming to the hospital, at least you get used to it in the sense that you feel like you're coming home. To hear Abigail describe her experience at Children's is exactly what it, what it should be. She doesn't have the reality of the heartache that it could be because she's masked with the, the happiness of what what it is. And I've been proud of Kendrick, and I've been prou proud of me, and I know Mom's proud of me too. Please help my brother and me have a healthier tomorrow. Visit giving.archildrens.org to make your gift today.